Day six concludes the group stages at the Total Energies Under 20 Africa Cup of Nations, Egypt 2023 Kosafa qualifiers, and in Group B, defending champions in first place, Mozambique have to sign, seal, and deliver a semi final place up against Lesotho in third spot, who play for pride and hope for an upset at the Somtola Stadium in Lobamba, Eswatini. A good day it is to you as we, well, Break down the group standings for you here for Zambia. They've already booked their place in the semi-final. The race very much on for the best second-place team. And Eswatini, well, did all they could yesterday. They scored goals. They got their goal difference up to six in concluding Group A. The hope results in the matches today in both groups that are in action today do stand them in good stead and give them a chance of, of course, qualifying for a semi-final spot. Mozambique, they, of course, are coming into this group uh, sitting in top spot. Angola can still and, uh, see them. So the battle on for Mozambique to just conclude matches here in a game where they will be expected to uh, come out with uh, three points. Lesotho will be hoping for the upset that may see them in the battle for second spot in this group, depending on whether Angola do get the better of Seychelles or not. Again, Angola expected not only to win against Seychelles, but to score a good few goals. So Seychelles themselves, like Lesotho, will be hoping to throw a spanner in the works of the Angolan team. So that is Group B. And now things look in a Group B here at Mozambique. Sitting pretty for now, but still have uh, so much to do in uh, turning things around here and confirming where they will stand. Group C has three sides in uh, the uh, running. Comoros have made history. Not only did they record their first win ever in uh, these championships, they've come up with two of them. Yes, and they're still top of the group. South Africa, yes, well, they bounced back against uh, Malawi yesterday. They still have work to do in uh, seeing things out here. Well, sir, well. The uh, Namibians sit bottom of the uh, group. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand for the national anthem of Mozambique. And now, the national anthem of the Soto.
Uh, yeah. For Lesotho, they have been able to uh, come up with the win against the uh, Seychelles, who sit rock bottom in uh, this uh, group, not having come up with the win. They are the only side not to have won in this group of the Seychelles. Lesotho looking to make it two and two, and uh, hoping to include Mozambique in uh, the list of uh, victims in uh, these championships. It will be a tall order against the uh, defending champions here. Mozambique, of course, did do the business in uh, the game against Angola, one of the uh, toughest matches they've had so far, and uh, they ensured they're top of the group. Now, for Mozambique, they'll have Daniel, who uh, sits uh, uh, at the uh, top of the uh, attack with them, uh, and uh, does have a goal he has scored so far. Watch out for Antonio as well. He's another who's found the uh, back of the net, wearing the number 10 jersey, while uh, Jva in uh, the uh, number 11 jersey has scored a, a couple of goals and will be a threat going forward. Antonio Dungola of Angola is the uh, referee in charge of uh, this uh, fixture, assisted by uh, Stanislas Plata from Angola. He's a countryman, of course, and uh, well, the second assistant is Mohamed Ibrahim from Comoros. Fourth official in this match, Kebetri Dindwa of Botswana.